to use a RAM disk to run um, DayZ on it. Okay, so first you're going to want to download RAM disk, the configuration utility. Uh, I'll put that link in the description. And then when you do this, you're going to want to open this. Okay, one second. Okay, so now I have a uh, RAM disk up. What you're going to want to do is, well, I set my disk size to 300 megabytes, which is, uh, I think, like 2.9 gigabytes or something like that. And then, so just set it to wh whatever megabytes, like three, it depends on the amount of RAM you have. Like, I only have six gigabytes of RAM, so I use three, or 3,000, which is 2.9. So pretty much, if you have, like, four gigabytes, don't bother doing this, because you probably won't have enough to really do anything. So when you do that, select FAT32 partition. And then you're going to want to go to the load and save part and hit load disk image at startup and save disk image at shutdown then you're going to want to start the ram disk okay so i let it i stopped my uh, recording because it took a little while uh... so now the ram disk started and it should have made a if you go to computer it should have made a new disk which is this one for me I already have my daisy stuff in there okay so now what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna need daisy commander like if you don't have daisy commander it's probably not gonna work for you uh, so launch that okay so now this is daisy commander and when you just go to settings uh, and you go down here to daisy directory and you hit override at first it's gonna look something like that right there the like it's gonna look like the arma 2 oa directory just get rid of all of it and then see look here i'll just do it right now it's gonna look like this and then you're gonna wanna hit override Take all of this, get rid of it, and then I'm going to go back up here, and then copy, and then right here, and paste it, uh, and then you just hit done, and then now you're going to want to go to uninstall and update and you're gonna but you go back to day z and you hit reinstall and then it'll install it all down into your ram disk what the ram disk actually does is it um it like so let's say your hard drive can't or your game can't it doesn't run well ram disk will make up for it and it will speed it up a little bit more cause arma 2 is pretty poorly optimized so you're gonna, probably going to want to do this and it's pretty easy and that's, that's pretty much it and then when that finishes installing you just hit done and you can get out of here well if you want and then you can hit like you can close this and it will still be running so it's pretty much it as you can tell my ram is at 95 percent so yes it does use a lot of your ram and but at least you're gonna be running it better all right thank you and bye